Hey everyone. Welcome back to Fun Animal Facts. I'm super excited to have you here today. Have you ever wondered what makes queen ants so fascinating? Well, you're in for a treat. In today's video, we're diving into some mind-blowing facts about queen ants that you might not know before. Trust me, you'll never look at these tiny insects the same way again. So, stay tuned. Before we get started, let me give you a quick overview of what we'll be covering. We're going to explore the life of a queen ant from her origins and role in the colony to her unique physical characteristics and extraordinary abilities. By the end of this video, you'll have a newfound respect for these incredible creatures. And if you enjoy learning about amazing animal facts, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. Let's start with how queen ants come into existence. Unlike worker ants, which are born from regular larvae, queen ants are selected from birth. They come from the same eggs as worker ants, but are fed a special diet that allows them to develop into queens. This special treatment begins right from their larval stage. The primary role of a queen ant is to lay eggs lots and lots of eggs. In fact, a single queen can lay millions of eggs over her lifetime. Queens are significantly larger than worker ants and live much longer sometimes up to several decades. Imagine being the sole mother to an entire colony that's quite a responsibility. Now let's talk about one of the most fascinating aspects of a queen ant's life, the nuptial flight. During this event, young queens leave their nest to mate with multiple males in midair. After mating, these queens will shed their wings and start searching for a suitable place to establish a new colony. Once she finds the perfect spot, she'll dig a small nest and lay her first batch of eggs. What's truly remarkable is that after this initial mating, queens can store sperm for years. This allows them to fertilize eggs whenever needed without needing to mate again. One of the most noticeable differences between queen ants and other ants is their size. Queens are often several times larger than worker ants. This size difference isn't just for show, it enables them to carry out their primary function, laying thousands of eggs. And let's not forget about their lifespan. While worker ants may only live for a few months, some queen ants can live up to 30 years. That's practically an eternity in the insect world. Queen ants also have some unique physical traits that set them apart from other members of the colony. For instance, during the mating phase, they have wings which they later lose once they've started a new colony. These wings are crucial for their nuptial flight but become unnecessary once they've settled down. Another fascinating feature is their ability to produce pheromones. These chemical signals help control the behavior of the entire colony. For example, they can signal when it's time for worker ants to gather food or defend the nest. When it comes to reproduction, queen ants are incredibly prolific. A single queen can lay thousands upon thousands of eggs over her lifetime. The process is quite complex after mating during the nuptial flight. She can fertilize each egg as she lays it. The fertilized eggs will develop into either worker ants or future queens, depending on various factors like diet and environmental conditions. Unfertilized eggs usually become male drones whose sole purpose is to mate with new queens. In an ant colony, there's a very strict hierarchical structure with the queen at the top. Her pheromones play a crucial role in maintaining order within this hierarchy. These chemical signals ensure that everyone knows their role, whether it's gathering food, defending the nest, or taking care of larvae. The queen's presence is so vital that if she dies or is removed from the colony, chaos ensues until a new queen can be established or the colony collapses altogether. Did you know that some queen ants can control multiple colonies? These supermoms manage more than one nest simultaneously through their powerful pheromones. It's like being the CEO of several companies at once. And then there are polygynous colonies where more than one queen coexists peacefully. This setup allows for even faster growth and greater resilience against threats. Queen ants also engage in some fascinating interactions with other species. For instance, they often form symbiotic relationships with certain plants or insects that offer mutual benefits. Some plants provide nectar in exchange for protection against herbivores. There have even been instances where queens exhibit surprising behaviors like adopting orphaned larvae from other colonies or collaborating with different ant species for mutual benefit. Wow! We've covered so many mind-blowing facts about queen ants today from their unique origins and roles within their colonies to their extraordinary abilities and interactions with other species. I hope this deep dive has given you a new appreciation for these incredible insects. And that wraps up today's video. Thank you so much for tuning in and spending some time with us. If you enjoyed the content, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and share it with your friends. If you haven't already, 
please hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you won't miss any of our upcoming videos. We always love hearing from you, so please leave your thoughts, questions, or suggestions in the comments section below.